every month I get inspired and creative ideas come out from nowhere. Ads in magazines, stories in magazines. I just took a look at this one and Katy Perry and I went, I think I can cut my hair off. And I did. This magazine had a great article. And wait till I show you what I did with it. So they asked Diane von Furstenberg, what is one thing you will never travel without? Uh, I mean, I thought for a minute, what wouldn't she travel without? And guess what she said? My tiny cashmere sweater, I'm sorry, my tiny cashmere pillow. And I thought, well, I can do that. Now this is the first one that I did. The one I'm going to try to make with you today is going to be a little bit chubbier and maybe even more creative. So let's get going with it. Here's the sweater. I go down to the Salvation Army and I rifle through the sweaters and I find the ones that have moth holes in them. Moths have dined out on them. Hopefully not right in the middle of it because then it's not going to be of any use. But I just sort of look here, cutting the middle out so that I can have a pillow. And I take this pillow, I would love to run into Diane von Furstenberg sometime and say, look at me. I have a cashmere pillow too. But if these triple ply cashmere sweaters at the Salvation Army, now this looks like a dickie we used to wear. Remember those? Okay, so anyway, these end up costing me a little more than $2. Because I do show the lady at the Salvation Army. I hope you saw that there are moth holes in this. I put it in the washer and dryer. Cashmere can go in the washer and dryer. So here we are. Let's see, I could finish this off just a little bit more smoothly maybe, following the lines here. Now, what I use next is a hot glue gun. A hot glue gun is always my friend, but I will tell you that the bigger hot glue guns for the bigger projects are better. You can get a little hot glue gun at a dime store for $2.99. And if you're doing anything else, stick to E6000. This glue I use forever in a day. Okay, so we're going to get going here. What I do is I go in about one inch. I wonder what side is the furry side. This is the furry side. I go in about one inch with my hot glue gun and just go down a little ways. I'm a quarter of the way through with my project, right here. Connect the two sides. I have a sewing machine. It's as close to being in storage as it can be because I don't have time for it anymore. Now I go down the other fourth. The glue gets hot. I go down one more fourth of it right here. Stick with me. Think of a $2 Diane von Furstenberg gift. If you've seen any of her things in Neiman Marcus, they're a little bit more than $2, but good for her. I love the romance between her and Barry Diller. I keep up with all this fan magazine business. Okay, now here's the second to last side. Look at how easy this is. No sewing. No buttons, no zippers, no dry cleaners. Now I'm almost finished. And now it's time for the stuffing. Ta-da! Santa Claus's beard. I like to stuff it a little bit more. So if you buy a few of these at a Salvation Army or rifle through your closet and take a look at some that you say, oops, that has a moth hole in it you won't have to feel so bad because you can make something grand out of it. Give it to a friend in the hospital, a friend who's suffering sadness, anything. These are so great. Now let's see if I have enough in here. The thing is, if you don't think you have enough, this kind of glue is very forgiving and you could just tear it apart and add a little bit more. But I'm almost done. 
okay right along here got it going now i'd like to look up and smile at you but i think i better deal with this hot glue four three two and one one and done so here is your darling little cashmere pillow for traveling because it'll probably be one thing that you will never go without now I want to show you another little PS here there's a few pieces left and I can make little snow caps for my kid grandchildren with this I can make little leg warmers out of these uh, this is another one over here I bought this one and I didn't like how tight it was around my waist and how turtlenecky it was you can cut cashmere and it doesn't ravel you can put it in the washer and dryer so I have this I cut the sleeves cuffs off I cut the bottom off here's another hat for one of my grandchildren and now what am I going to do with the bottom part it stretches so I'm stretching it out and then along the top I'm going to hot glue gun a little ruffle so I have the ruffle I have the loose waist I have groovy cuffs and I'll figure out something to do with the end but just remember I made this one in five minutes I made this one in about three minutes so if you want to give somebody a gift they will never travel without make them a little travel triple ply cashmere pillow <laughs>